Getty slash Candice Albrey has been accused of trying to keep the UK and the youth through the back door speaking from more thing. Miss Salbury raised concerns surrounding the economic welfare of the UK and renewed violence on the Irish border if Prime Minister Theresa May buckled to ministers within her cabinet pursuing a hard vision of Brexit. Miss Salbury said, the government's own impact assessments say that the best deal for our country as we leave the European Union is to retain membership of the Single Market and Customs Union. You cannot avoid a hard border unless you stay in some form of customs arrangement in the single market. But Miss Shriver shut down the conservative lawmaker, blasting, in other words stay in the U. Miss Salbury responded sharply, no, 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 we will leave the U's political structure. BBC Ms. Salbury raised concerns surrounding the economic welfare of the UK following Brexit You cannot avoid a hard border unless you stay in some form of customs arrangement and the single market Anna Salbury in defending her position, the conservative lawmaker added, just this week I have met every single one of the organizations representing British business across all sectors and across all size. You cannot underestimate the very genuine and real concerns that there are about our economic prospects and peace in Northern Ireland unless we get this Brexit thing right. I have been consistent. I stood last June on a platform that I would make the case for the single market and the customs union and the positive benefits of immigration. And if we do that, we leave the political structure of the EU but we retain the benefits economically that it delivers including peace in Northern Ireland. However Ms. Salbury criticized the government's lack of clarity surrounding their desired customs arrangement with the EU following Brexit. She said, It is deeply regrettable that the government after nearly two years has still not decided what it has as a vision of Brexit. And pointing to Mrs. May's own struggles over the issue, she added, as she's listened to businesses, and understood the very real dangers in Ireland for peace and so on, I think she is frankly now struggling with a group of people, mainly in my party, that want this hard off the cliff, no deal Brexit. There is currently deadlock in the cabinet over whether to pursue a customs partnership model with the EU, or the maximum facilitation option. Mrs May is pushing for a customs partnership with the EU which would see the UK collecting import tariffs on behalf of the EU, but this option was rejected by six of eleven ministers in Mrs May's Brexit cabinet.